Hey, Gillen here from The Brokerage. You know, we talk a lot on this channel about how to help people with their Medicare. But what about the folks who are approaching retirement? Maybe they're not quite 65 yet. What do we do to help them? Well, in today's video, our friends at Pivot Health are going to teach us how we can bridge our clients to Medicare. Hey, good morning, everybody. I want to thank everybody for taking time out of their busy day. We're going to be talking about discussing and providing solutions to your clients by offering a lower cost alternative to the ACA, while at the same time building your book of business for the 60 plus crowd. There's a ton of opportunity within that, that space. So this webinar is dedicated to what we call bridging your clients to Medicare. So this strategy is going to help your clients transition to Medicare. So, you know, with, with the alternative individual medical space, you know, it's designed to be a lower cost alternative to the ACA market or the Affordable Care Act plans. You know, those may be a good solution for some individuals and some families who need health insurance coverage. You know, maybe they qualify for a tax subsidy or even a partial subsidy. Maybe they got a pre-existing condition that, that they need covered or they need one of the 10 essential benefits. But, you know, I always call those cookie cutter plans and these don't always fit everybody's particular healthcare needs. Obviously somebody in the 60 plus crowd uh, does not need maternity coverage. You know, they've got, um, you know, their, their kids have left the, the household, you know, now they're, they're looking at transitioning, they're possibly looking at, you know, retiring early and, you know, so they're not going to need that type of coverage. So why pay for benefits that you don't need, especially when you're paying for benefits on your own, meaning you're not getting a subsidy from the government, or maybe you're getting a partial subsidy, but, um, you know, what I'm going to do is I'm going to review this strategy, why you would want to target this audience, and I'm going to show you who this audience is. I'm also going to give you a very high level review of our plans, and then I'm going to give you a live demo of how easy our technology, our platform is. So, you know, when you do get contracted with us through the brokerage, which is one of our top partners, you know, we're going to build you a web portal. And you, this is going to give you the capability to not only view your book of business, but be able to email customized quotes directly to your client, and then they can enroll right from that email. And of course, you get credit for it. So I'm going to give a live demo of that. Also, I'm going to go over some great bonus in, information for you. Now, if you're not familiar with who Pivot Health is, Pivot Health is <clears throat> we operate in the alternative individual medical space, as I call it. So, you know, what we are is we're not the actual insurance carrier, but what we are is we're the product development management and marketing company. So what that means is we build the products, we put all the benefits together, we rate them, we file it with the state, and then we get to actually hand pick the carriers that we want to work with. And of course, we only work with A-rated carriers. Now, we were launched in 2016, so we're relatively the new kid to the alternative individual medical space. But, you know, those at the helm of at Pivot Health have been in the business for a very, very long time. I myself have been in the business for 16 years. You know, I started out as an insurance agent. And then uh, after several years into the field, I decided to kind of work more on the general agency side and, and more the product distribution side. And then in September of 2018, I did come on board with Pivot Health as a broker account executive. So very familiar with the broker distribution model, something that I love doing. I love working with agents. And, you know, that's another thing uh, at Pivot Health. You know, each and every agent does get a dedicated account executive because, you know, we recognize that you guys work with a lot of different companies. You know, you want to have a lot of tools in, in, on your tool belt providing solutions for your clients. And you, it, it's helpful to have somebody, a, a go-to person when it comes to Pivot Health. You know, every, every carrier's business rules are, are different, you know, which is why we're rated excellent by our trust pilot reviews, but not, not only from our members, but also our agents as well. Now in 2018, we were bought by healthcare.com and healthcare.com is a leading insure tech company. Basically they, you know, they study people's buying behaviors when it comes to uh, the alternative individual medical space or, or people that are purchasing individual medical insurance. Now what makes Pivot Health so unique? 
What makes our product so unique? So we build products to target niche individual markets, which is one of the things that we're going to be talking about today is a very uh, niche market, you know, the 60 plus crowd that we've found to be very underserved. Um, so we provide an array of products. So we've got our short term medical. We've got our defined fixed benefit programs and, of course, our ancillaries to help complete the benefits package. Um, when it comes to technology, you know, we built our site with not only the consumer in mind, but also the agent in mind. And we've designed it to be super easy. You know, I get a lot of feedback from agents out in the field and they love how our site works and how easy it is to use. So as I mentioned earlier, we, we build you a agent portal where you can build customized quotes, but we also build you a unique URL link that you can actually put on your agency website if you have one and um, you can direct traffic there and folks can quote enroll themselves all within a few minutes and then of course you get credit for it and when it comes to services i mentioned you know we are top notch when it comes to agent support as well as customer service for our members so we were all rated 4.6 stars out of five now when it comes to our overall product suite you know, again, we operate in the alternative individual medical medical space. We only have individual medical programs. So our stable product is our short term medical programs. You know, we've got lots of duration options, you know, from 30 days all the way up to three years. We've got lots of different plan designs. So depending on what your client's budget is, we've got an option for them. We have options that have op office visit co-pays, wellness benefits. We also have options with um, national networks as well as our open access plans uh, where they can see any provider, any facility, any facility, any provider can submit a claim and it'll be paid accordingly. And we use reference-based pricing and that includes balance bill protection to protect your client from owing anything above and beyond what our reimbursement is when it comes to those covered services. We have our new defined benefit or fixed benefit programs where there's no deductibles. These are called our anchor plans. There's no deductibles. There's no co-insurance. This is true first dollar coverage. We do have options with increasing hospital confinement benefits. Also, we do a blended benefit where there's no difference between sickness or injury. We also, our program has no life, overall lifetime maximum. And it also does include patient ab advocacy service to help that consumer uh, be smarter when it comes to their, their medical services. And also includes bill negotiation. And that's also included on our open access short-term medical programs, which is new for us. Uh, we have our ancillary programs and that helps co complete the benefit package. So we've got our dental and vision options, options with no waiting periods. The vision is set up through VSP, which of course is the household name when it comes to vision insurance. And um, we also have our supplemental program, which is a package critical illness, accident, hospital indemnity and AD&D &D program that is guaranteed issue. Now, both of those programs can be added to any one of our short-term medical plans uh, but it also can be sold as a standalone option. You know, maybe you're in a situation where somebody needs a guaranteed issue medical program, so they need an ACA program, but you want to help them out uh, by offering them a solid dental and vision as well as a supplemental program. So let's talk about the who, why, what and when it comes to the 60 plus crowd, that pre-Medicare market and how you can help your clients transition to Medicare at a much lower cost than an ACA plan while at the same time building your book of business. So we've uh, we refer to this as, as bridging your clients to Medicare. So as agents, you come, come across the 60 plus opportunities more than you might think of, which I'm going to get into shortly. So, you know, as an agent, again, you're, you're in the business solving problems and providing solutions. So what you're doing is you're, you're actually enabling your client to pay for benefits that are relevant to their market segment. They're, so they're not paying for benefits that they're not going to use. So, you know, I gave an example of this earlier, you know, they, they don't need maternity coverage. Um, they also definitely don't need uh, pediatric dentistry. So, you know, some of those 10 essential benefits that are lumped into the ACA plan are not necessarily needed. 
And especially if they're paying for their own coverage, they're paying for insurance with their own money, they don't qualify for a subsidy or even a partial subsidy. You know, at the end of the day, premium is always going to dictate buying behavior. So, you know, the short term medical market it can be a, a, a definitely an attractive lower cost option for your clients. So, you know, we call this building your you're bridging your clients to, to Medicare strategy. So, you know, ACA plans at this age are, are very example, uh, very, very expensive. So for example, you know, we've got a 63 year old, you know, they're, they're looking at going on Cobra, um, you know, they were leaving their, their work, um, you know, they're, they're possibly retiring early, um, but then they're looking at a uh, ACA option. Uh, the premium was gonna be $860 a month. Now they did qualify for a partial subsidy, but it was still going to be over seven hundred dollars a month, and a short-term medical premium with a large deductible that uh, this person was comfortable with was close to fifty percent less than an ACA plan. You know, the, the short-term medical plan, and I'm not talking a bare, a bare bones plan. I'm talking about a uh, a short-term medical plan that has no network restrictions. Any provider, any facility can be seen and um, they can submit a claim and be paid accordingly. Also a 100% plan after deductible is met and it includes an RX, uh, a prescription copay drug benefit. With the savings that they, um, with the savings of the, of the short-term medical pr program versus an ACA option, they were actually able to also purchase our Latitude Supplemental Program to help pay for that larger deductible in the event of an accident or critical illness. So next, I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you who makes up this market and why you would wanna target this market. So who makes up the pre-Medicare market or the, the, uh, the 60 plus crowd. So you've got several options. You've got a, a lot of opportunity within this, the 60 plus category. So number one is the baby boomer generation. You know, you, you work the Medicare market. You've heard this stat all the time. You've got 10,000 people turning 65 every day. Well, same thing can be said for those turning 60, 61, 62, so on and so forth. So you've got a ton of opportunity there. Uh, early retirees, you've got uh, a lot of folks that that are looking, they've worked hard all of their life, they're looking at retiring early, um, but they're also delaying retirement because they are afraid of losing their benefits. They're gonna lose their medical coverage. And of course, you know, if they are retiring early, you better believe they're not gonna qualify for any type of subsidy. Also, uh, you've got um, another situation how many times have you been sitting across from a Medicare recipient and you're enrolling them in a Medicare program, but their spouse is only 62? Uh, so they have a few years to uh, before they transition over into Medicare. Um, so, you know, that that I'm sure you've come across a, a thousand times. And again, you know, you've got somebody that's delaying retirement due to, uh, you know, they're, they don't want to lose their benefits. Um, so they are they don't want their spouse to be uninsured also you know maybe if you work the group market and you've got somebody you've got a group that is you know looking at doing a level funded medical program you know level funded medical that they underwrite the the group and, you know somebody at 65 or, or greater you know that's going to really skew that that medical rate that the actuaries come up with for that particular group so obviously you enroll them in a medicare plan but what about their spouse um, so, you know, there's a, a, a ton of opportunity within the six, 60 plus category. So let's talk about why you would want to focus on the pre-Medicare market. Well, number one, you're increasing the lifetime value. You know, typically it, when it comes to short-term medical, short-term medical is paying higher commissions than ACA, assuming that ACA is, is even paying any comp right now. Um, you know, I, I hear that uh, that uh, next year the the ACA premiums are going to go up fairly dramatically. And uh, you know, what, what's one of the first things that they do? The the carriers do in order to kind of offset that um, that increase in premium. Um, th that's a reduction in commissions. So you know that that's certainly a possibility. Um, also, you, you're creating value. 
by saving your clients money. And with that savings, you can add ancillary products to complete the benefits package. Obviously, the more lines of coverage that you have with your client, you know, and when I'm when I'm referring to ancillary products, I'm talking about dental and vision as well as a supplemental program that we have. Um, so with that savings over the ACA plan, you're able to complete the benefits package and the more lines of coverage that they have with you, the more loyal they're going to be with you. Um, obviously, they're going to stay with you and be more loyal to you. So looking at the stats, you know, folks in this age category are, they're starting to look early, you know, looking at their options early. You've got, you know, 80% of of 64 year olds start to look at their options. Um, so you see a, a dramatic increase, you know, 30% over 63 year olds. Um, so, and number two, you're, you're securing your leads by offering products that bridge them to Medicare. So uh, you're able to, to help them transition uh, into Medicare. And of course, you know, insurance is a pipeline build, business. So you're building your book, book of business and you're providing coverage for the entire household and you're setting yourself apart from competition. One of the things that I always like to say, if you're not showing it to your clients, another agent will. Um, so it's it's best to, to have as many tools in your toolbox as possible. And, and you know, the best leads are your own book of business. And number three is now you have a free Medicare lead when they are about to turn 65. So in that sense, you've essentially decreased your Medicare lead costs because you have a, a, essentially a free lead. Well, it's not really free because you've actually been getting commission on it over the last several years. So again, you're helping them transition into uh, Medicare. And then when they're ready to transition, ready to turn 65, you've got somebody right then and there, they're gonna reach out to you or obviously you're gonna reach out to them to help them get over to Medicare. So, you know, as agents, and I, I keep saying this, but you're, you're in the business of solving problems. So we call this bridging your clients to Medicare. So how do you do that? So you do that by offering short-term medical extended durations. You know, uh, over the last couple of years, we're, we're, we are now allowed to offer extended durations. In the majority of states, we're able to offer up to two or three years worth of coverage. That's what we call extended durations. So, you know, perfect example, you've got somebody that is 62, you put them on a three-year plan, you're protecting them for those three years prior to them enrolling in Medicare. And then again, you've got a Medicare lead right then and there when they're ready to turn 65. Um, so, you know, you're offering those extended durations and those also, those are designed to be lower cost alternative to the ACA for those who don't qualify for any subsidy monies are, are whole or even partial. Um, you could also offer one of our anchor fixed benefit plans and you you can, uh, that's more of a permanent solution, but um, that you can combine with a critical illness and accident plan to form a, a fairly comprehensive benefits package. And with our anchor program, it is guaranteed renewable to age 74 you know, for those scenarios where, you know, maybe you've got somebody that has not been in the United States for uh, a long time, maybe they, they don't qualify for any, uh, you know, Medicare benefits. So, you know, once they get past the initial underwriting of our anchor plan, you know, they can keep that to age 74. But like I said, you can combine that with a critical illness and an accident plan to form a fairly comprehensive benefits package. And again, similarly with the savings, you can add value with additional lines of coverage by offering the ancillary dental and vision as well as the supplemental products. Now, speaking of extended durations, um, with the extended durations, here are some certain rules on that. And this is how you actually protect your client uh, for those couple of years before they enroll in a Medicare plan. So as I mentioned, we can do up to two and three years uh, de depending on the state, but in, in, in Texas, which is our number one state, by the way, um, we can do up to three years on the majority of our plan designs. So what you're doing is stacking three 364 day policies on top of each other. So the benefit of doing that is you only have to go through underwriting just the initial time. And we do simplified underwriting, by the way. Um, so that's accept or reject on the spot. 
So you don't have an additional application to fill out when you go into the, your new coverage period. Also, everything is all on cruise control. When one policy ends, the next one starts automatically. So there's no gap in coverage. There's also no new waiting periods that apply to the subsequent policies. Also, your benefits start over when you roll into your new coverage period. So if you're on a copay plan, um, we, we have uh, on all of our copay plans, it's three per person per term, and those do reset when you go into your new coverage period. Also, we don't do a lifetime max. Uh, we do a true term max. So um, when you roll into the new coverage period automatically, you get a new set of, of uh, term max. Now, the flip side of that, your, your deductibles and your coinsurance maximums do start over. Um, now, the extended duration must be selected at time of enrollment. You can't add it later on down the road. It must be added at time of enrollment. Now, of course, we give a 10-day free look with a 100% uh, refund. And if they, you know, if they decide, you know, after they enroll a couple of days into their 10-day free look, they certainly can cancel, get a full refund, and then reapply. Also, one of the big benefits of doing the extended duration is that let's say a new condition, of course, short-term medical, there's pre-existing condition limitations and exclusions, just like any other short-term plan. Uh, but if it really and truly is a new condition that popped up in the first term, it would not be considered pre-existing in the second or third term. So again, you're protecting your client for the two to three years uh, on an extended duration prior to them enrolling in Medicare. So those are just some of the business rules when it comes to extended duration. And, and now you can see why uh, you're able to protect your client for those few years prior to enrolling in Medicare. But, you know, if you've got somebody that say at 60, you know, obviously they've got five years prior to uh, enrolling in Medicare, you know, they can keep doing that as long as they can keep pass, passing through the uh, medical underwriting each time. So, you know, for example, if somebody is age 60, you can enroll them in a three-year plan. And if nothing happens during that three years, once that three years is up, you can enroll them in a two-year plan. Uh, again, they have to answer medical questions once that three years is up but then you lock them in for another two years. So uh, again, that's a great way to protect your client at a lower cost than an ACA plan while earning commissions. So that's, that's the strategy in a nutshell. Now I wanna talk about our plan designs. Uh, we do have lots of different plan options. Um, and this is our overall product portfolio. Uh, we do have, uh, four different series of programs. Now the quantum plans are not available in Texas, um, but you know, if you do work other states, so maybe you work, you know, Nebraska or, you know, some of the Midwest, uh, also Arizona, um, Florida, you know, the Southeast, it is available there. But uh, with each of these different series, it's, it's really designed to target a specific audience and specific uh, budget basically. So we, we built these with certain audience in mind. So, you know, looking from left to right, we have our core plans. Our core plans have lower deductibles. There's also access to the First Health Network. Each uh, plan has office visit copays. Those are three per person per term. Um, it also includes prescription drug benefit, whether it's a discount card or a, a copay drug card. Now that program, who we wanted to target with that is we wanted to target somebody that is looking for a low cost premium with good first dollar benefits to looking to have everyday items covered. So when I say everyday items, you know, items, uh, first dollar coverage for sickness or for an injury, you know, with those co-pays to the doctor. Uh, also prescription drug benefits. So those everyday items, um, you know, as real, really and truly first dollar coverage. Now, in order to be able to offer that first dollar coverage with a low cost premium, it does include fixed hospital benefits. So, you know, basically it's going to pay a fixed dollar amount in the hospital or cover a fixed dollar amount. Anything above that is going to be considered not covered. But you do have access to the First Health Network. 
So even though there's fixed hospital benefits, it's going to stretch further than you might think. But again, that target is for somebody looking for a low premium with good first dollar coverage. We've got our classic series. Now, those of you familiar with us, these are probably the ones that you are um, you know, most familiar with our plan designs. So this is series in itself is a very well-rounded series. You have options that are low cost where it's just covered services subject to deductible. But then we've got higher end options where not only does it include office visit co-pays, but it also includes uh, prescription drug benefits with low out-of-pocket costs as well. Um, now, all of these, you know, this really any any age appropriate. Um, these classic series is a well-rounded series in itself. All of these are open access, so it means that any provider, any facility in the United States can submit a claim and will be paid accordingly. We use reference-based pricing. Uh, the reference-based pricing is a is a it's a percentage of the Medicare fee schedule. And that includes balance bill protection in case the provider decides that they want to, to charge above and beyond what our reimbursement is. So uh, balance bill protection is, is definitely a key feature to our open access plans. Um, our next series that we have is our EPIC plans. Now, uh, we built this series, we were getting a lot of feedback from agents that their clients were looking for expanded wellness benefits. You know, when it comes to short-term medical, you know, it's designed to be a low-cost alternative. So, you know, you sacrifice certain coverage uh, in order to keep the premiums lower. So, with that said, the short-term medical world, the short-term medical market does not include a lot of wellness benefits. So, we wanted to build a plan that included expanded wellness benefits. So, um, it, this has some great benefits such as the, the wellness mammogram is covered automatically at 100%. Um, the, the prostate PSA testing for men uh, is also covered at 100% as long as it's uh, considered a, a preventive. They're 100% plan. So once the deductible is met, the plan pays 100% of covered services. Incidentally, the family deductible is two times the individual versus three on some of our other series. Uh, also, you can throw on a copay drug card if you wish. You can also throw on an optional accident rider to help pay, uh, give you, um, you know, some additional coverage. Uh, we do have two versions. We have an open access version, and then we have uh, access to the Cigna network. Now, the Cigna network for us is not available in the state of Texas. So in the state of Texas, we just have our Epic base plan, which utilizes the open access, so reference-based pricing with balance bill protection. So a great option for somebody that's looking for expanded wellness benefits. And then our quantum plans, as I mentioned, um, these are not available in Texas, but this is uh, like the Cadillac short-term medical program. So it's got a lot of benefits that are not typical for short-term. Uh, it includes some uh, additional wellness benefits. Uh, you have a copay option as well as a high deductible option. It utilizes the Cigna network. It also includes a supplemental accident rider baked right into the plan. It'll pay up to the deductible. So those are our different series of plans that we've got available for you. Um, and these are available in Texas uh, with the exception of the Epic PPO and the Quantum plans, but the Epic base is available in Texas. All of these can be written up to three years in the state of Texas with the exception of the EPIC plan. That can only go up to two years. So that's our high level on our short-term plans. Um, I do want to give you some stats here. I do want to show you. Um, so this pie chart, this represents Pivot's block of business. So as you can see, the 60 plus crowd, which is in the, the sort of the, the teal blue there, um, that's that 25% is our block of business for the age 56 plus. So uh, the, the 60 plus market is going to continue to increase over time. So that tells us a couple things. So that tells us one, they're able to pass through our underwriting. Uh, there's kind of a misnomer that folks in that age category are unhealthy. Um, but, you know, your, your kids are out of your house and now they're, you know, you're taking care of yourself. 
Uh, so, you know, you can they are able to pass through our underwriting. Also, this also tells us that the, the 60 plus category, we see folks, they're looking, they're actively looking for shorter or other, I'm sorry, they're looking for uh, lower cost alternatives to the ACA. So, you know, that, that's some, some good um, information there for you. Also want to show you what our pre-Medicare rates versus our competition. So uh, we've got our Pivot Deluxe plan. This is one of our richest plan designs that I've actually seen on the market. So it's got a $5,000 deductible. It's got 80-20 to additional 3,000. So total max out of pocket is 8,000. It's got three office visit co-pays, uh, 30 for your primary, 64 specialist or urgent care, an actual copay drug card and coverage up to a million dollars. And it is also open access. As you can see, the premium in comparison to some other, uh, our, our top two competitors, um, you, as you can see, the premium is extremely competitive uh, in the, the 60 plus space. Now, what makes us, what makes our short-term medical programs so unique? As you saw, we've got lots of different options depending on what your client's needs are as well as their budget. We have options that use national networks. We also have options where there is no network, so any provider, any facility can submit a claim. Also, we do simplified underwriting. This is a huge differentiator. Even on our extended duration plans, we do simplified underwriting. So no rate-ups. We will take a type 2 diabetic as long as they're diet controlled, uh, so no medication. We will accept um, also controlled hypertension. Now, of course, both those conditions are going to be considered pre-existing and their pre-existing limitations as well as exclusions. We also don't need uh, social security numbers. Uh, so as long as they've lived in the U.S., now my chart says uh, 12 months, but we recently had a development where it's only four months. So as long as they've been in the U.S. for four consecutive months, prior to the application date, then they're eligible for uh, to enroll in our programs. We've got options with co-pays, 100% plans, wellness benefits, prescription drug benefits. Uh, also something new is a partnership with Point Health on our open access plans that includes healthcare navigation, as well as bill negotiation services. So, you know, if you're having trouble finding a provider, uh, with our reference-based pricing, our open access plans, all you have to do is pick up the phone, give them a call, and they will help find you a doctor. And then, of course, the bill negotiation service is a huge tool. Student athletes. So uh, we, again, target niche markets. Uh, that's not an exclusion with us. So if there's an injury related to a high school or college sport, we treat that as any other in injury. Uh, child only plans. So, you know, the full spectrum, we go six months of age all the way up to 64 and 11 months, which leads into that pre Medicare market. All of our plan, plans include free and unlimited telemedicine that includes dermatology. So, that's uh, what makes us unique. Um, so, those are, you know, definitely some, some big uh, ticket items that definitely separate us from some of our competitors out there. You can complete the benefits package by offering our ancillary programs. Uh, we partner with Renaissance, so they've got a huge national network. Uh, it is a pivot proprietary product. Uh, we have options with no waiting periods. All of our plans include free uh, cleanings paid at 100%. And we have a couple options where they actually get three cleanings per year per person. Uh, also childhood ortho on our top plan. Uh, we've got a couple options with progressive benefits, so those, those benefits get better. That includes the annual max. Then, of course, the, the vision component is set up through VSP. Again, the household name when it comes to vision insurance. We've got our latitude gap plan, which is a package critical illness, accident, hospital indemnity, and AD&D &D program all rolled into one plan. You've got $2,500 benefit or $5,000 benefit, and that's guaranteed issue. So, um, you know, let's say you've got the scenario where somebody needs an ACA plan. They need a guaranteed issue medical product. You can also sell them this, and this will help them pay that high deductible. 
Now, both of these products can be sold as an add-on to a short term, which is easy as clicking a button, which I'm going to give you a live demo here shortly. And that is going to, um, but you can also sell both of these as a, a standalone product. And just to show you some rates, um, since we're you know looking at the the sixty plus crowd, I want to show you. Uh, we've got an epic plan, $10,000 deductible. It is 100% coverage after deductible is met. It's got uh, the million uh, term max. You add on the latitude preferred, which gives them, gives them that accident critical illness component, the dental and vision, all for huge savings over a, uh, an ACA program. The whole benefits package versus uh, uh, a ACA plan without any additional benefits at close to $1,000 per month. All right, now let's talk about our technology. Let I wanna show you how easy it is to use um, our technology. As I mentioned, you know, when you do get contracted, you we do build you an agent portal to where you can build customized quotes, uh, and then you can email that directly to your client. So let's do a live demo here. So once you log in, you go into an agent resource center. You can, of course, view your book of business. You've got um, information on our all of our products. And so you have a whole agent resource center that you have access to. But for time uh, purposes, let's just build a, a quote. So I'm going to show you. And also this is co-branded. So your information is listed up here. So when somebody views a quote, they can, they'll be able to see your, your information. So we're gonna do a short term. We're gonna do 60. You can have next day effective date. You can also go 60 days out. We're going to do a 364. And I'll also show you how easy it is to be able to uh, add the extended duration. So we do have some items here to, to help you out, give you some um, you know, choices. I know we've got a lot of different options, um, but you know we've got tools to help you out. Uh, also, don't forget to utilize your sources please feel free to pick up the phone and give me a call. Happy to help any way I can. Um, you've got filters you can use. Now, I really like the Epic plan, to be honest. Um, I think it's one of the best options out there, uh, especially when you're talking um, benefit coverage. You have a lot of different deductibles that you can choose from, um, but you can go as low as 5,000. Now, of course, that's gonna jack the premium, but these are 100% plans. So you got to remember once the deductible is met, the plan pays 100% of covered services. But you've got some customizable features here. And this is also where you add the extended duration. See how easy that is? Then you can complete the benefits package. You can add the dental vision component. You can add the latitude. Now this plan, uh, okay, there we go. All right, now you can email all of this over to your client. And then within seconds, the client will get the email and you also do get a carbon copy of it. So see how easy that is to be able to add, and you just heard the ding, you see how easy that is to add those additional benefits and email the entire quote out uh, all within minutes. Now, if you've got somebody that's ready to go, they're ready to apply, continue to check out. And this is what starts the medical questions. Now I'm just gonna speed through this. Um, you know, our questions aren't, again, these are simplified underwriting. So accept or reject on the spot. Um, you know, we don't ant ask anything out of the norm that's out of the industry norm. So I'm just going to roll through these. And of course, play around with the website. If you're already contract with us, feel free. You're not messing anything up. You're not really actually starting anything uh, until uh, you actually go to submit.
but you got your payment information here. We do take credit card or bank draft. Uh, we do take premium right away, regardless of the, the, the effective date. Um, you can also make some additional changes here if you wish. You know, you can change the start date. Um, the e-signature is also part of the application and then click, click on start your coverage and then boom, your client is enrolled as long as payment goes through. All right, so that's a live demo on our platform here. All right, so that concludes everything. Oh, I do want to don't um, don't want to forget, but we've got some uh, great bonus opportunity. You know, if you haven't written with us for a while, we've got a reactivation bonus. We're going to pay you for your first three sales. Uh, if you're newly contracted, you haven't sold anything yet, we're also going to pay you for your first three sales. We do have our uh, quarter three bonus, which is extremely lucrative. Uh, so depending on the duration that you sell, we're going to pay you some extra cash. Uh, there's no registration for this. All you have to do is sell five medical applications. Minimum premium must be $100 per month. Um, and then the minimum duration must be 90 days. It must st stay on the books for 90 days. Uh, but this is uncapped. Um, you can earn as much as you want. Uh, so let's see. Also, here is... Uh, contact information. Here's my contact information for product support. And then if, if you're not contracted, uh, the brokerage, again, is one of our top partners. So um, please feel free to reach out if you're interested in getting contracted. And we've got Belinda's information there for you. But let's take a look at some of the questions we've got. Okay. It looks like one, how long is the pre-existing condition? And it would be 12 months. Look back. So in the state of Texas, um, the when it comes to our, our look back period, what is considered pre-existing, it is it's uh, two years. Um, so it, it, as long as they've had um, they have not had any kind of of treatment procedure or anything for a particular medical condition within those two years, it would not be considered uh, pre-existing. Um, and, and when I say treatment, that includes medication, uh, again, procedures or, or any kind of testing. Um, now, when it comes to pre-existing conditions, um, <clears throat> you know, pre-ex, uh, there are pre-existing condition limitations and exclusions, even for our extended durations. So uh, we actually have a, a great benefit for uh, pre-existing conditions on our program. So as long as the plan covers it, we have what's called a pre-existing condition allowance. So that means that we'll cover those little things. So those little doctor visits, um, some prescription medication up to half of the deductible. So that's what we call our pre-existing condition allowance. And then we have a question. When the client receives the quote, do they have the option to complete their application at that time? Yes, so they will. Um, they they can complete the application. So as soon as they get it, they they have the option to complete the application. They also can go and view the quote online. So maybe they want to do it a different deductible. Maybe they want to add a spouse. Um, you know, they they certainly have full capability to do that. Okay, um, what is the RBP percentage to physicians, and what is it for hospitals? The reference based pricing is 125% of Medicare allowable at the doctor's office and then 150 at your facilities. So it's better than Medicare. And again, that includes balance bill protection for those covered services being subject to the deductible. So, you know, what that translates to is a great uh, fee schedule. You know, it, it's great for lower out of pocket costs to the member because that, even though we're paying better than Medicare, the average discounting that we're seeing is almost 70% off a of full retail or, or the full doctor or facility charge. That's the average. Your average PPO is somewhere between 30 and 50% off a of full retail. And then with the balance bill protection, they're covered. They're protected. I do see one other question. Um, it was a question about the bridge to Medicare. So the bridge to Medicare plans, we're actually sunsetting those. Um, those programs will no longer be available. Uh, that program uh, was kind of our first stab at an extended duration. Uh, but now that 
you know, our EPIC plans, our deluxe plans, our other classic plans can go up to two and three years. Um, the bridge to Medicare plans themselves are kind of like an old dinosaur. Um, so with, with that, um, those other extent plans that can go extended durations, they're, they're better better fit for, in my opinion, uh, a lot more competitive rates. Um, how are claims handled? Um, so just like any other insurance program, the, the member receives an electronic ID card. The ID card actually includes step-by-step -step instructions. Now, this is for the open access plans, of course, um, meaning there's no network. But uh, with the open access plans, there is step-by-step -step instructions for the provider to follow. And if there are, of course, any questions, they, there is certainly a, a phone numbers listed all over the ID card to verify benefits. Um, and uh, it's all handled electronically. Great. But the provider and the facility should be filing the claims, just to clarify that. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching this video. If you'd like more content like this, remember, you can always go to thebrokerageinc.com. Head over to our webinars page to find more.